Hello everyone today we are discussing about Golden Retriever. It is Scottish breed of dog. The Golden Retriever is a Scottish breed of Retriever dog of medium size. It is characterized by a gentle and affectionate nature and a striking golden coat. It is commonly kept as a pet and is among the most frequently registered breeds in several Western countries. It is a frequent competitor in dog shows and obedience trials. It is also used as a gun dog, and may be trained for use as a guide dog. The breed was created by Sir Dudley Marchbanks at his Scottish estate Guiseken in the late 19th century. He crossbred flat-coated retrievers with tweed water spaniels, with some further infusions of red setter, Labrador Retriever and Bloodhound. The breed was recognized by the Kennel Club in 1913, and during the interwar period spread to many parts of the world. History. Naus, sitting, at Wazakan, 1870s. The Golden Retriever was developed in Scotland in the 19th century by Sir Dudley Marchbanks, later to become Baron Tweedmouth, from flat-coated retrievers judiciously crossed with Tweed Water Spaniels and some other British dog breeds. Prior to the 1952 publication of a very detailed stud book which had been meticulously maintained by Marchbanks, a number of romantic tales were published about the origins of the breed. In the 1860s Marchbanks set out to create what to his mind was the ultimate breed of retriever at his Scottish estate was Aachen. He started by acquiring a yellow-colored flat-coated retriever dog called Naus. Naus had been whelped in June 1864 and was the only yellow pup in an otherwise all-black colored litter. Whilst uncommon, occasionally liver, brown, golden or yellow-colored purebred flat-coated retriever pups are whelped to matings of two black parents. It is the pedigree of Naus that was the source for the romantic tales of the heritage of the Golden Retriever. One early account claimed Naus was purchased from a Russian circus trainer in Brighton, another claimed he was bought from a cobbler, and yet another claimed a gypsy. The stud book states that Naus was a flat-coated retriever bred by Lord Chichester on his Stanmer Park estate near Brighton. In 1868 Naus was mated to a tweed water spaniel bitch named Belle, who is recorded in the stud book as being whelped in 1863 and being of Ladykirk breeding. The litter from this mating consisted of four yellow pups, Primrose, ADA, Cowslip and Crocus. The best bitch from this litter, Cowslip, was mated to a tweed water spaniel called Tweed with the mating producing a bitch pup called Toxie. Cowslip was subsequently mated to a red setter called Samson, that mating produced a dog pup called Jack. Toxie was mated with a black flat-coated retriever called Sambo and a bitch pup from that litter. Zoe was mated back to Jack and two pups from that mating were retained, a dog called Mouse 2 and a bitch called Gil. Gil was mated to a black Labrador retriever called Tracer, and a bitch pup from that mating, Queenie, was mated back to Mouse 2. All golden retrievers descend from this mating. The progeny from these various matings varied in color from pure black to light cream but it was the golden-colored ones that were retained and mated to each other, forming the foundation stock of the golden retriever breed. Marchbanks is also known to have used a sandy-colored bloodhound and another Labrador in subsequent years of the breeding program. In 1952 Marchbanks' great-nephew, Giles Fox Strangways, 6th Earl of Ilchester, teamed up with Elmer Stonex and together they studied Marchbanks' stud book. In 1960 their research was published, presenting all of the evidence required to counter all tales of Russian ancestry. The stud book, which covers the period from 1868 to 1890, is preserved in the library of the Kennel Club in London. Winifred Charlesworth with two of her Golden Retrievers, 1910s. In the early days Golden Retrievers were called the flat-coated retriever, Golden, initially the Golden Retriever was considered a color variety of the former breed. In 1903 the Kennel Club recorded the first examples, listing them in the same register as flat coats. In 1904 a Golden Retriever won a field trial and in 1908 the first examples were exhibited at conformation shows. In 1911 a breed club was formed for the breed in England, the Golden Retriever Club, and they were given a new name, the Yellow or Golden Retriever, from this point they were increasingly seen as a separate breed from the flat-coated retriever. 
It was not until 1913 that the Kennel Club began recording them on a separate breed register from the flat-coated retriever and in 1920 the yellow or was dropped from the breed name and they were officially called the golden retriever. One early 20th century enthusiast of the breed, Winifred Charlesworth, was instrumental in the establishment of the breed club as well as its separate kennel club recognition. It was she who drew up the first breed standard, which was adopted by the kennel club and with only minor amendments and remains largely unchanged. She bred and exhibited the first Golden Retriever show champion, was a strong advocate for maintaining the working instincts of the breed, and she is credited with popularizing it at field trials and introducing it to shooting sportsmen. In the years after the First World War its popularity increased markedly and in the 1920s and 1930s it spread through much of the Western world. The Canadian Kennel Club recognized the breed in 1927, the American Kennel Club in 1932, the first examples were registered in France in 1934 and Australia in 1937. The worldwide popularity of the breed meant it did not suffer the misfortunes many British dog breeds did during the Second World War due to British wartime restrictions on the breeding of larger dogs, with ample quality breeding stock available globally. Temperament. The Golden Retriever is considered an intelligent, gentle-natured and very affectionate breed of dog. As is typical with Retriever breeds, the breed is generally calm and biddable, being very easy to train and extremely keen to please their master. The breed is known to make excellent pets and family dogs, being generally extremely tolerant of children and keen to accompany any member of the family in a range of activities. Due to their affable natures, the breed is often completely devoid of guarding instincts. However, there have also been reports of some very aggressive golden retrievers in certain lineages. It has been suggested that these variations in aggression are partially caused by genetic factors. The breed usually retains many of the gundog traits and instincts including an excellent sense of smell and a strong instinct to retrieve. Even among those not trained as gundogs it is typical for golden retrievers to present their owners with toys or other objects. Compared to other retriever breeds the golden retriever is typically quite slow to mature. Health. Golden retrievers are a generally healthy breed, they have an average lifespan of 12 to 13 years. Irresponsible breeding to meet high demand has led to the prevalence of inherited health problems in some breed lines, including allergic skin conditions, eye problems and sometimes snappiness. These problems are rarely encountered in dogs bred from responsible breeders. The breed is unusually prone to cancer, with one United States study finding cancer to be the cause of death in approximately 50% of the population, the second highest in the study. Several European studies found a much lower prevalence 20-39%, to which may reflect the significant genetic divergence between the American and European populations. They are especially prone to hemangiosarcoma and lymphoma, with an estimated lifetime risk of 1 in 5 for the former and 1 in 8 for the former. The high prevalence of cancer deaths among golden retrievers may partly represent a lack of other congenital disease popularity and uses. Retrieving a shock game bird. The golden retriever is one of the most commonly kept breeds of companion dog in the Western world, and is often among the top 10 dog breeds by number of registrations in the United Kingdom, the United States, Australia and Canada. It is a frequent competitor at dog shows. Separate show lines of the breed have been developed. The dogs can be trained as guide dogs and therapy dogs, and may compete in obedience trials and other dog sports. The Golden Retriever is still used as a gun dog by sportsmen, both as a hunting companion in the field and for competing in field trials. It is used more for retrieval of land-based game birds such as grouse and partridge than for wildfowl hunting. Those used as gun dogs are usually from working lines specifically bred for field use. Dogs from pet or show lines are rarely suitable. A golden retriever with a traditional dense double coat is well suited to working in cold and wet conditions, as the coat provides water resistance and insulation. Compared to other retriever breeds, the golden retriever is not a strong swimmer. Its long coat causes it to sit low in the water when swimming. The golden retriever is much less commonly used by sportsmen as a hunting companion than the Labrador retriever. 
One reason is that the breed is generally quite slow to mature, particularly compared to the Labrador. Often when a Golden Retriever is still in basic training a Labrador of the same age has already completed a season of hunting. Another is its long coat, which requires more maintenance and grooming than that of the Labrador, particularly after working in muddy conditions or close cover, as their long hair is more prone to picking up dirt and burrs. More Golden Retrievers are bred as pets or for the show ring than for hunting, so it can be hard for sportsmen to find pups bred from proven working lines.